What's going on guys? My name is Wade with Tech Daily. So I've obviously had the chance to try out a number of different projectors at this point, but I've yet to try out one like this. This is the AWOL Vision LTV 3500. It is a high-end UST 4K projector with 3D support. And besides all that, it's also probably just the brightest projector I've ever seen. This is outside the realm of my usual tech gadgets. At $5,500 just for the projector alone, it's no doubt an investment. And you should also use this with a proper ALR projector screen too, by the way. But even if you don't have that and just end up using some blank wall, it is still going to rival any 100 plus inch 4K TV you could buy that would likely still cost twice as much. Now the AWOL 3500 is definitely a bigger UST projector. It's still an ultra short throw, but you should factor in at least a decent sized living room table or stand to set it up. It's about two feet across and 14 inches deep, but as long as you have some space away from the wall, you can get a screen size of up to 150 inches with it positioned about a foot and a half away. My screen size here is like 100 inches or so, which honestly is plenty for this space, but I could probably pull it away from the wall even a little more if I needed to. Now the 3500 in the name refers to the peak brightness, 3500 lumens. That is incredibly bright for anything really, but specifically a UST projector like this. And brightness is probably the selling point for the AWOL vision. And in fact, 3500 lumens on a projector like this is as bright as some higher end TVs. So this could absolutely replace whatever you currently have at home. You could absolutely watch content on this projector in broad daylight with every window open if you wanted to. My space obviously has a lot of light even at night, but it is not an issue. And with the lights off, I think you can tell that the image you get is pretty ridiculous. It absolutely rivals any high end TV display at this size. And I would argue that the flexibility to get as big of a screen size as you want paired with the easy setup and minimal glare makes it an all-around better option than some 100 inch tv anyway like i mentioned a projector like this should be paired with an alr or ambient light rejecting screen that helps ensure you get the sharpest picture without any fade or haze from the city lights or your living room lights or even the projector light bouncing off the walls and i'm sorry i'm missing that element here that's the next purchase for sure but even still, with a flat white wall, this projector produces an incredibly bright and perfectly sharp looking image. By the way, if you're in the market for something more affordable, AWOL Vision also has their LTV 2500 UST projector. It's very similar to this one, but half the price and with a maximum brightness of 2600 lumens. And if you want to learn more about either of these, head on over to AWOLvision.com. I'll also have links down below in the video description, as well as some 5% off promo codes. And there's also another limited time deal going on right now where you can get a free 120 inch ALR screen or motorized fluorized screen with the purchase of the 3500 projector. So definitely jump on those deals if you're interested. To get some of the other specs out of the way, the AWOL Vision 3500 is a true 4K resolution, HDR10 plus supported projector, and it delivers some 1 billion colors with 107% of the REC BT2020 color space and 147% of the DCI-P3 color sphere. That's a bit hard to comprehend, but when you see this projector in person, you can really get a sense of just how sharp and how colorful it is. It feels weird to describe a projector image in this way, but the darkest areas of the screen are a true inky black without being noisy or distorted, and the brightest areas are an absolute true white, and everything in between is as saturated and contrasty as you could want without being overdone or looking artificial. I would think achieving this standard of image quality would be pretty tough on a UST projector, but AWOL Vision got everything right. I should also mention that the AWOL Vision supports MEMC or Motion Estimation Motion Compensation, and essentially what this does is smooth out fast-paced content like sports or action films for a better overall experience. It cuts down the jitters and choppiness and fills in the gaps in frame rate that might occur with super fast on-screen movement, and this just leads to a much more enjoyable experience that some other projectors aren't able to offer. Also, I'm personally not much of a gamer myself, but I should mention that the projector offers a relatively low input lag, 30 milliseconds with 4K resolution and 17 milliseconds for 1080, which for a UST non-gaming specific projector, that's really pretty good. So not only are your games playable, but they should be more than enjoyable. It's not going to be PC competitive, but you shouldn't have any noticeable issues with gameplay. So one of the more unique areas of the AWOL Vision is actually how it supports some of your inputs. Obviously around back you've got your usual array of ports, power, a couple USB-A, HDMI, and 
including eARC audio, but included in your purchase is actually an Amazon Fire TV Stick 4K. And on the back side of the projector, you have a dedicated hidden compartment with power and HDMI that's made specifically for the Fire TV Stick or other small sized streaming device. So that's awesome. It frees up a couple ports and keeps everything really tidy. The user interface for the AWOL Vision is also very straightforward. The included remote, by the way, is really nice. It's big with this metallic finish, clicky buttons, easy to navigate. You'll probably use this remote a lot, so I'm glad to see it's a nice one. And if you enable the CEC option in settings, the projector remote can actually control the Fire TV stick that's plugged in directly when you power it on, and it'll jump right into your Fire TV home screen. Outside of your input selections and various settings, there aren't any other pre-installed apps or anything like that, so you'll have to connect up something to the projector, which again is why I like that hidden HDMI compartment around back and the additional software support there. But as long as your connected device and content supports it, you'll be able to enjoy the full bright color and super sharp viewing experience that this thing delivers. If you need to make any image adjustments, there are pretty robust setting options. Of course, there's keystone corrections for just adjusting the edges and borders of the screen, which you'll need to do during setup, and that's super easy. There's adjustments you can also make to the image itself for brightness and color, but to be honest, I don't think any adjustments were needed beyond the default profile. One other item you probably saw there is 3D mode, and yes, that's exactly what it sounds like. The projector does offer a dedicated 3D viewing experience for content. Using a pair of DLP Link 3D glasses, you can actually get a pretty solid 3D experience with this projector that mimics what some 3D TVs might do. But on a screen size this massive, it's actually closer to more of a 3D movie theater like experience. Obviously, I can't really show you what it looks like over the camera, unfortunately, but if you have the right content for it, the 3D mode does take this viewing experience to another level, and it's obviously not a standard feature on like 99% of other projectors. When it comes to the sound, the AWOL Vision does have 36 watt stereo speakers built right in, which absolutely makes this a great all-in-one setup. It's really good sounding audio that absolutely fills the room, and I'll give you an audio sample in just a second so you can hear what that's like, but just know that the built-in speakers are probably going to be more than enough if you just want to keep things simple. This relatively little humming or fan noise coming from the projector, and the speakers can get really, really loud with very little distortion. But with both Bluetooth audio support and your audio inputs around back, I think most people who invest in something like this would probably put together a great home theater surround sound setup anyway, but like I said, you don't really need to. The AWOL Vision 3500 is far and away the brightest, sharpest, and most colorful projector I've tried yet. It's also the most expensive too, I totally get that. But a projector like this is for someone who wants the ultimate experience, a full-fledged home theater or perfect wall-to-wall -wall living room setup. It's priced this way because I think it is well worth all that money, and the specs and performance certainly justify it. If you're looking for that ultimate viewing experience in a UST projector, or if you want to get something way bigger than what would be reasonable for a standard 4K TV, this is definitely the answer. So there you go, that's the AWOL Vision LTV 3500, one of the craziest UST projectors I've tried yet. Truly an ultimate viewing experience to say the least, but what do you guys think of this thing? Let me know in the comments down below. I'd love to hear your thoughts, of course. Hopefully you guys did enjoy this video though. Be sure to follow Tech Daily on Twitter and subscribe to the Tech Daily YouTube channel if you haven't already, and I'll see you guys later.